Hey fellow crypto enthusiast, welcome to today's quick trend analysis. Let's get started. Today, find out how the price of Bitcoin has changed and what the technical indicators SMA, Divergence, Stochastic RSI and MACD show. If you are unfamiliar with the indicators, check out the explanation videos below. If we look at the hourly time frame for Bitcoin, the price went up only slightly with around 0.4% in the last 24 hours, with a current price of 16,709. Jumping to the hourly simple moving averages, at the moment, the price is between the 20 and the 100 SMA. If the price bounces off the 20 SMA which is currently at 16,622 it could be seen as a support and the 100 SMA that is at 16,762 could be perceived as a resistance to the upside. If there were to be a break either way, it means that there could be a continuous move in that direction. Moving to the hourly stochastic RSI, there are no signs of the stochastic RSI being oversold or overbought at this time but we can see that the trend is currently going down because the K line is below the D line. Jumping to the hourly MACD, seeing as the MACD line is above the signal line, meaning that the trend is currently on the up. However, the MACD histogram shows that the momentum is currently shifting to the downside and it could be expected that the price will consolidate and it is better to wait and see if the MACD line will cross the signal line, which will be bearish. Jumping to the three hourly simple moving averages, the current price is between the 20 and the 50 SMA. If the price bounces off the 20 SMA which is currently at 16,599 it could be seen as a support and the 50 SMA that is at 16,916 could be seen as a resistance to the upside. Breaking either way signals a possible further move to the corresponding direction. On the lookout for divergences in the three hourly time frame, the price has already gone up owing to the last bullish divergence. Moving to the three hourly stochastic RSI, both the percent %K and percent %D lines are in the higher region, which means that the price is getting overbought and soon a trend change or at least some kind of consolidation could be expected. Nevertheless, the K line has yet to cross the D line, so it's recommended that you wait and see if the trend does in fact go down. Jumping to the three hourly MACD, the MACD line is above the signal line, which shows that the current trend is on the upside. Looking at the MACD histogram, we can see that the momentum is strong at the moment and we can expect the price to continue growing or maybe at least remaining the same for some time. Generally, the bigger time frames have a bigger impact on the price, so please keep that in mind when we show different time frames showing contrasting indicators. Also the shorter time frames are only representative for the short term trading. Thanks for watching and know that every few hours new videos are uploaded analyzing different cryptocurrencies, so be sure to hit subscribe and not miss out. If you have any questions, leave a comment below and we'll get back to you ASAP. Also, keep in mind that you should make your own investment decisions as cryptocurrency trading is very risky and these daily videos only an overview of trends and are a purely technical analysis without considering the fundamentals. See you next time.